And we're back again. <clears throat> One thing I better do is Judge this guy up there. over here. I believe this is where the Enigmata's got oh, hidden away, so we so we'll go pick that up. And then from there we'll go find another cultist to kill. Sanctuary there, but I think it's this one. Ruined Sanctuary of Ajax. something else. Oh, thank you for this as well. More treasure here somewhere, ain't there? Here we go. Give me that. No, I'm looking for something. particular I think it's at the sanctuary no worries we
Alright, there we go. It's the eagle. Plus two seconds burning. Alright, so where to from here? I can head down here and check this location. Might as well. I'm right here. Temple of Athena, Skidas. of great importance here. Hey, I know what you see, man. And from here we to I'm pretty sure I marked this guy didn't I? Okay, maybe I didn't. What are you printing, uh, sprinting for? Uh, Pre-MZ a lot. Uh, Prepare to die then. Can help raise my rank, Priam. <laughs> you're here for my bounty and you're gonna die, okay? Should've stayed away, Malaka. Oh, what the hell? Sleep now. What's up? Welcome back to the stream if you're rejoining. If not, welcome to the stream. <laughs> oh, damn. It's way more friggin' DPS than my one. That's in the swords. 20% crit damage. Sheesh. Hold on there, bro. Hold on. Hold on. So my other one has 10% hunters and 10% warrior. 20% uh, crit. That's very good. 60% Oh, 6% hunter. So no, no. Well, then my other one's got 6% overpower. Which I do like quite a bit. Mm. I'll keep it as is for now.
These maps are so huge. Man's coming for you, bro. Sleep now. All right, so we can get another stele from here, then, eh? Which is good because I need one. So you can always do with points. Oh man, I can't use my torch. Maybe I won't be going in here then. I need to fast travel or something. Or I'll quick save actually. I'll quick save here and then I am going to Once I quick save I'll um reload it because it's not allowing me to switch weapons at the moment. It's doing the whatever glitch happens so I'll quick save and then I'll reload the save and hopefully there I'll have my abilities back then I can pull out my torch and roll through the dark caves So forgive the load screen. This game's hindering my progress a bit. I need one more cult kill and then I can level up my spear to level 4. There we go. That's what I want to see. <clears throat> this will be my first time using my other arrows as well, by the way. Keep a sharp watch here. I haven't used any other other ones because of um, the fact that when I was finally going to use them, it wouldn't let me switch. Helm is this? Damn, it's battled up. I'm gonna beat the heck out of that helm. Sleep now, snake. So I found another one of these tombs. I can go pick up some uh, another ability point from the delay or steel, however they pronounce it. It's not spelt the same way as steel, but I don't know how they pronounce it. Woo, that was close.
See the tip of the sweet. Yo, by the way, if you if you enjoy what you're watching and in, and you haven't um, clicked the follow, feel free to hit that follow. I pretty much I'm gonna I'm gonna run this playthrough as much as I can till I've completed it. Hit 99, I guess. Or maybe not. I'll do like the main story, I guess. And if anyone wants me to continue from there, then I'll I'll continue from there. If they want to see me hit 99, otherwise I don't want to bore them with content that they might find it no longer um, appealing to them. But if it is, then sweet, hit that follow. Feel free to. I'll have to sort out times, like a proper time for when I can stream. I'll set up a... Oh my god, these snakes, man. I'll set up a um, schedule at some point. And I'll find a time where I'll be confident on being able to get on all the time. But otherwise, it's like, for now, it's pretty much every day. Random timing. Oh, ow, what? What? This whole time, here's me smacking these things. And all you have to do is press triangle next to it. This game needs to, <laughs> to let you know that. It needs to damn well let you know. Okay. <laughs> well, well. The things you know. Oh. Ow. Wait, did that even do damage? Damn snake. Is there even anything in here? Well, he's a long snake, man. Tricked me, eh? Tricked me. There was nothing in there. Just want me to go in. That's what we're looking for. Some treasure. Thank you, thank you. Hey, feel free to type in the chat too if you wanted to talk about anything. Otherwise, if you're just enjoying it, sweet. Oh, oh, oh. Alright, so I'll show you what I mean. All you need to do, if you didn't know this by chance, is walk up to it. Oh, you don't even need to press triangle, just walk up to it. Simple as that. And he just interacts with it. Why is it telling me there's a bounty hunter on me? Did he come into this temple? Oh, he must be above me. So it's even better, you don't actually have to tap triangle, you can just stand by it for a short time and then he'll light it himself. <laughs> That's so friggin hilarious. All these times I've been catching fire trying to light them. And I didn't even have to. Alright. 
what's in here? Man, could you imagine finding things like this in real life? It's this sort of thing that made me love the idea of archaeology when I was a kid. I wanted to become an archaeologist because of things like this. It was like Indiana Jones, Tomb Raider, those sort of shit. I wanted to be that kind of archaeologist, you know, the one that's running away from boulders that are chasing you after a trap got set. <laughs> it was my old life. It's, that was what I wished I could do for a living. Run away from giant boulders. Holy shit! What's up, bro? How's it going? This dude is a freaking giant. Is that Ajax? What the hell, man? He is massive. I'm in um, the Messinaean, Messinaean, whatever how you, how you spell it. Michaean oh, Mycenaean Tomb of Ajax So I'm getting the stele steel There's a dude in here sitting on a throne, so it's a skeleton sitting on a throne and he's what you would expect Goliath from the Bible to be a freaking giant Yeah, I'll take a photo of him for you. Dude is massive, bro. Hold on one moment. Sorry for the blue screen. Man, he's pretty big. He's pretty damn huge. Sorry about the blue screen. This is everything. This is all there was in here. He's massive, man. Hmm, 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 Alright, so there's some stupid ass bounty hunter who thinks he can take me on. He doesn't realize I'm a god. Got to be careful not to get spotted. That's you, bro. Ooh, somebody gonna get a hit real bad. Somebody. Ow. It's probably gonna be me, jeez. Ooh, somebody. Gonna get the hit. Come for me, big boy. Come here. You're going to get the smack down. Look at that. Look at this hood. You're not ready for this. Ooh, it tripped you up. Fucking stupid. Ah, shit, that was quick. You're making me cough. Why you making me cough? Get out of here. Ooh, ooh, you make me cough again. This no fear how you do this to me. I'm going to kick you away, okay? Wait. Nope, that was the wrong way. Oh, no, no. Never mind, give me my health back and die. You have lost the right to live in your stupid poisonous plates. 
ornate dagger. I did need a new dagger, so let's see if this is worth putting on. Oh, my dagger's alright, but I ain't using poison. Ten percent hunter, uh, twelve percent damage on Athenian soldiers, fifteen percent crit damage. Yeah, actually, I do like it. I'll equip it. Like I haven't even tested and tried all my weapons and everything yet. Oh, that's right, I've got the Athenian War Hero Gauntlets. I'm going to do all arrows, pierce shields, and 50% hunter damage. 11% hunter damage, 60% oh, 6 damage with overpower abilities. Yeah, no, nah, I like my gauntlets. They have crit chance. golden feather oh was that in the yeah I mean didn't even mean to I, kn I knew Ajax was a part of some mission I couldn't remember which mission it was though so I didn't realize I was bloody doing it though the glorious golden feather said to have been woven into oxhide shield carried by towering Ajax son of Telemon oh. Telamon one tale says it was plucked from the body of Zeus while well, he was in the form of an eagle but who knows I can imagine that man some crazy ass dude brave enough to go and steal a feather off of Zeus as an eagle Colors of gifts. I still haven't even gotten a figurehead yet. Is there anything else I'm missing on this island? And nope, discovered everything. Is it cult member? Why does it keep unmarking him? Okay, he's way over here. This is the closest I can go to him. Might as well go here. Get the other fast travel on the way to him and then hit him up. It's 
So do you live stream or anything, Olaf? Why not, man? Why not? If you got spare time while you game, like it's free to live stream, especially if the PS4, yeah, you can just straight up broadcast. I just like to do it. I feel like if I'm playing, might as well. Most of the time, my bros hit me up. They're just like, yeah, put on cheap players, let us watch. I was like, ah, I'll just stream it where you can watch on the stream. <laughs> yep. Oh, is there no docker in here? Yep. Talking like Elmo. What a boss. Oh, what the hell? Where's the closest port? Oh, it's over here. Man. Going out any farther is a good way to get capsized. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Come off it, bro. What the heck? Nice. Oh, that's the volcano island. I've been meaning to go and check that out. I've got, um, for my lieutenants on my ship, a rolling wolf. What's his name? Bayek, Evie, Aya, and Odessa. So I got three assassins, special lieutenants, legendary lieutenants, and and just in the legendary Odessa. to be big. Nice. 
of Hephaestus. Let's see. This is really the forge of Hephaestus. Is he in here? The god who made the weapons and armor for the gods? Oh hell. Damn right. It's lava. Man, this dude should be dead by now. Just breathing in this air would have burnt his insides. Is that Hephaestus? Hephaestus sure seems angry. I wonder if it's because of the war. Hey? <laughs> the uh, the sun hit. What the hell? Malaka, got to get it out. <laughs> I fell in the lava. No, I'm still all good. How the hell are you gonna survive falling in lava? For this guy who doesn't really believe too much in the gods or anything, he doesn't seem too shocked that we're in a place where the gods punish the dude who makes their armor and stuff. I think Hephaestus was punished into being kept here to be in the forge. Can't remember. Dude. Thought he could come after me. Time to hunt by night. You all good in there, bro? Having a nice bath, this old statue. Whoo, that's bright. Even the lava in this was realistic, eh? It's crazy. Come, come at me. You're only gonna disappoint yourself. What's up, bruh? What's up? You want some of this? You want some of this? Get off my stadium! This is mine! This is mine! Ow! Get the worst out of my face! Somebody gonna get a hurt! Ow! And that somebody is me! Oh, come on then, man! Come on! You wanted it, you got it. Don't complain, okay? The heck? I'm 
bandit bow. These guys are the craziest thing. They may be Lear in a volcano. Further down. Oh, that leads out. Go up then. Okay, so this is the second door I've come across like this. I can't remember where the first one was. That's the second one. Oh, it was in the Cave of the Oracle. I might as well bloody get that skill. Sense things. The Millennium Puzzle. more in it, so at some point I'll be able to go into those doors and those rooms. Not really a skill that I'd want to use my points on. The um, his awareness one, where he can see where treasure in that is. Yeah, it help. It'll help when you're like just trying to rush through certain areas and not have to worry about too much. Just to know exactly where to look for the particular things. But at some point I'm going to level up everything to its max. So it's alright. Plus I could always just restart. Like um, refresh all of my ability points. Me up sometimes.
Wakey, wakey. Get your asses up. <laughs> I actually don't mind this pirate ship color. Oh, that's right, I can wear that bloody chest plate now, eh? Definitely, definitely wearing this. doesn't realize that death is coming for him, eh? Your microphone's quiet as well. Temple of Poseidon. I should be extra careful in this area. That's a restricted area. You're gonna die, bro. Get out of my face. Give me your shield. Get out of my face. Don't be stupid. Don't be stupid, little peasant guy. I said, don't be stupid, bro. Get out of my face. <laughs> Give me your shield, fool. Oh, 
uh, the one of the gladiator style cult members. So I think it should. <laughs> you thought that was gonna save you? Foolish. Peace. Give me your shield. And your dog's gonna die, sorry, bro. You shouldn't have brought it to fight. Man, y'all look crazy trying to run back to me. Hey? <laughs> like at the rate I climbed the ranks, you'd think that these mercenaries would know better by now. <laughs> give me your shield and give me your shield too <laughs> You didn't just get killed, you got killed, killed. There's people that get killed, and then there's you getting killed, killed. Oh! Oh no! I stabbed that dude right in the balls. He was up on a ledge and I was killing him from underneath and then had done one of those finisher style kill offs and he just straight stabbed his sword like sword up his friggin dress <laughs> that's savage and yes I called it a dress oh man I wouldn't want to die that way well might as well Oh, you got a legendary sword, mate. You're gonna die. I'm gonna take your sword. I'm gonna take your sword. You the spark. You the spark was a seasoned mercenary when she was hired to track down a missing person in focus. She found her mark near Kirha, in a ruin filled with figures of clay and unfamiliar soldiers. Once freed. Her target thanked her with a curved sword, dirty with clay and wrapped in a bundle of rags. Prometheus's, uh, Prometheus's, Sika. 15% fire damage and build up, 12% fire damage, 11% warrior damage. Legend says this blade was forged in Prometheus's benevolent flame. If true, the sicker is truly a gift from the gods. What happened? Damn. Your head for a fistful of drachmi. <laughs> <laughs> I kicked the stairs. Get off the stairs, yeah. That's it, come down here. 
Komm, Dani. Now dodge my abilities. Trick. Assassinating enemies of particular things is pretty annoying in this. You're strong. Good. Gather your things and meet me at my ship. Okay. I don't even need him that like you could just for that anymore. Because eh? I can use my ability to find these things. I'm not doing I'm not doing anything, babe. What are you talking about? <laughs> I'll get it there, but I might not. Yeah, it's fun. I usually get about two or three on me at a time. It's bloody annoying because I'm. They show up when I'm taking on a fort, so I'm in the middle of. Yeah, I'm in the middle of rumbling like a, a whole bunch of enemies, and then all I get is like two friggin' mercenaries show up. Now I'm rumbling them, and then a third one shows up. It's like, bro, come on, come me some slack. Just trying to take over this place. Fire out, nothing that big, mate. Give me all the loot, man. Give me the loot, man. Yeah. Oh, look who's come to play. You want some of these, bro? Oh, somebody's really gonna get hurt a little bit. You shouldn't have brought your dog to the fight, man. I have to tell you guys this all the time. All the time, man. Not most. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I just picked up, um, I got, um, Prometheus's sword is skilled. Complete. Ah, oh, there is.
What types of games do you get into, bro? Played. Hey? Nah, I don't have GTA 5. You get into, um, ever played Destiny? Have you ever played Destiny? Both, either one. Yeah, Disney one was the better one out of the two. I've got both of them. I just haven't bought the latest DLC for the for Disney two. Couldn't be bothered. Got bored of it, stopped playing. How's it going? Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the stream. Oh no, I've been streaming for ages, bro. Hmm. I also checked to put the bounty on me. Just having a look and see if I can find any fast travel locations around here. Athens. Athens is all ruined now. Yay yay! I've been doing upgrades and stuff. Upgrading my armor, weapons, things like that. Boat. This is my loadout. Phobos! My magical horse. I can go level up my spear now. Salmon. Oh yeah, I'm not really after any money at the moment. Like, I get it back pretty quick. But I'm, I'm not really after it at the moment. I'm just trying to smoke up some Cosmos crew members and that, pick up some, yeah, pick up some armor in it. Uh, Ooh, I like, I'm tempted to use this, eh? Excuse me. Uh, I might keep it on this for now. Or should I? Oh no, I like the sword. Them. 
Man, people are missing out. Straight up. It's literally a game that you could put hours and hours into and you still got heaps to do. Here. <laughs> we spend the Achilles. Five percent damage dealt restored as health. What is the A bro? That's a normal though, you can expect that from most people. Yeah. <laughs> of course, I know that is. Sorry. I've seen that, very. I've seen that. It's crack up. I did that in a stream once, one of my first streams. Because the bro was asking me to find the highest place. I was like, hey, I'm in your favorite place, bro. <laughs> uh, I went to, because uh, I was only on um, Catalonia at the time, I hadn't left Catalonia. So I took him to the highest place that I could find. I was like, look, here's your favorite part of the map. And it was just hanging from his balls. It's like, I'm a pube. Miss. Most ultimate transformation, I turned into a pube. So, <laughs> <coughs> about to you anyway, bro? Are you in America? Hmm. But COVID will be so bad over there, eh? Not where you are. Well, that's good. So I know it's pretty bad in a lot of other places. Like over here, we haven't. The only places that have gone to like level three lockdown for like over a year is Auckland. Which is the place where they fly people in from overseas. When people come in from overseas, they go to Auckland and they get put in lockdown. And then if anything breaks out there, like if anything breaks out there, then they just lock down their town to level 3 and the rest of us go to level 2. So we can still roam around in that, but going in and out of Auckland is like a pretty big no-no-ish.
YouTube. Josh Dub. Is it there, Momo the No No Bear? You wanna know what my farts smell like, eh, Ray? <laughs> I'll keep it in my list, but I'll check it out later on tonight. <laughs> I feel like there's something in here that I can grab for some reason. Fragments now, eh? All cave objectives. Oh man, so I got like quite a few caves to get. Well, not much actually. Seven. Another five bandit camps. Talk to the Spartan soldier. I've only done two leader houses. No. Okay, so I've done one of the choosing maps. Last one, uh, map to room and feather location. Oh, I got, I got the feather without even having to worry about the other maps. Yeah man, like, the games that I was hard out into since a kid was always adventure games like this. You know, I used to play, like, Banjo-Kazooie, Legend of Zelda, Karina of Time, things like that. There's Nintendo 64 days and then Assassin's Creed that come out. Because I used to do free running myself, it was like a felt at home playing this type of game. one of the reasons I hired out and enjoy this. <laughs> I 
Go to gold through the bur. I like Zania. She's cool. Um, Zania. Yeah, one golden eagle. A request. Ah, oh, what a pretty, pretty king. Glad you're happy. No, my pain. Calm yourself. Here, for your trouble. Thanks. <laughs> you flew like the west wind in retrieving my golden. <laughs> but the offering is said to be a craft of golden bracelet, as beautiful as Aphrodite, with workmanship to rival that of Hephaestus. It would look better on a priest than on an altar. <laughs> Damn, I'm gonna bling the shit out of this part, king, queen. I had one of my royal crew, Anaximandros, draw several maps to show you the locations. He's clever with his stylus. Any guards at these holy sites? Probably not, though I suppose you risk offending the gods and earning their enmity for all time. Oh no, takes please. Takes that sort of thing. <laughs> Good enough for now. I'll keep an eye out for the place you want. You boy, level 31, let's go. Only another 69 levels. Wait, no, no, no. 66 levels to go. See, the crazy thing about Valhalla is you can go up to like four, level 400 and something, something like that. Hey, bro. Hey, how's it going, huh? In back. How's school, man? How's your presentation? Oh, they're very hard. It's in the chat. Not bad, you? Yeah, not too bad. It was good. It's the one, so I'd like to hear. Oh, you missed a few uh, Cosmos kills. <laughs> Thanks for taking care of those sheep, Mistios. So I've killed a few of the cultists now. Hmm. No problem in doing that soon. Not too mean. I just upgraded my spear. Cool, let's see, you got a level 2 spear now. I think I just got mine to level 4. Literally just a moment ago before you joined the the um, stream. level 1 2 and I have 9 hours in the game. Nice. You're going up pretty fast man, your level is increasing pretty fast. Uh, I see you have oh the Berihan. 
He's at level 12. He's only done 9 hours in the game. He's at level 12 already. Crit chance yet. Two five percent crit chance with Harry Strike. Hmm. What should I put on this one? Credit to shot to the stadium. My Twitch crashed. Oh, it's all good, man. Hopefully, you've been like enjoying your time while you've been leveling up. I'm just trying to figure out what I should engrave onto my weapons if I should actually put anything on them. Yeah. It's so fun. Hundred <laughs> percent. Let me just do this thing by shot. Two percent chance no damage with bows on distant targets. Might as well go fifteen percent heat shot damage. My teacher is redoing the same class from yesterday since a big part of the class did not do the work. I did it so he let me leave. <laughs> and that's how you do it, man. It's way better, way better to get through class and smoke out everyone else, you know, because they they didn't want to do it, so they didn't get the the goods of being able to leave. <laughs> Poor chaps. I am going to deal a lot of damage, I tell you now. You mind if I start a party with you? Um, you can join in um, me and the bros party if you want. Oh, the Barry Han wants to join in the party. That's all good. Yeah, go send me um, send me a friend request, Han. In 1-6 by the way, I let people know cause some people are uncomfortable when they are with younger people. Oh, that's all good, way.
shields, speeds and stuff. Let me do the bow to shot. Yeah, one of the bows is in the stream. Oh, so you're. I didn't realize it was your um, <coughs> your gamer tag. Hold up. One moment. There you go, very joined up. Fifteen percent damage on animals. I don't really care too much about that. Oh no, I could use that actually. For, for hunting the legendary beast. How's it going, bro? So I got hunter damage for headshots. Four percent damage. Oh. How's it going? <coughs> Not badly. Not too bad, yes. Yeah, not too bad. Just trying to figure out what best I can, like, what best engravings I can put on my weapons and armor. <laughs> yeah, I just got to Athens, so I'm uh, I'm going up to get Parthenon. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Oh, quite a bit of weapons that I got. That I, um. Yes. I saw that. You've got so many. Yeah, some of them I don't even know what to do with, like, to be honest. It's like, I'm debating with myself whether I sell them or just dismantle them and get material. All the pens <laughs> you have a lot of Drachme? Uh, my Drachme goes up pretty fast. For some reason, I get, like, triple Drachme. Like from the um, collectors, oh not the collectors, the deluxe edition that I got. So I get triple drag me all the time. Nice. Yeah, I don't know if I have that because I got the game, like I said, one, it was on sale for like 27 bucks. And it's the deluxe edition, so. Oh yeah, you should get, you should have it too then. So you got it recently, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, nah, same with me. I didn't want to buy it at its full price, I was like, no, nah, I'll wait, because I knew they were going to drop it at some point. You always go yeah. for the best deal. <laughs> the summer is the time where I spend the most amount of money in video games. <laughs> yeah, hard out. That's why I got oh, this one and Origins. I got the both of them. Yeah, like last year, because of quarantine, yep. I would play story mode games, but it would take me like two or three days. Hmm. Like Avengers, it took me maybe a week. I did most, like, I did all the main missions. I was done. Yeah. Uh, Miles Morales took me two days. Damn. But that means, like, I wasn't, like, because I work sometimes during the summer, but due to COVID, like, my, my job got cancelled because it wasn't, like, completely necessary. Yeah. Yeah, it sucks, man. Like, COVID's been a hard out impact on heaps of people. Yeah. So, what's your best armor set that you like to use so far? Um. Well, since I got the. Since I got the. Like the deluxe edition, I got a bunch of like legendary armor at the start, and I just upgraded those, and they're really good. Yeah, so there's a trick. Um, your best bet is to not upgrade your armor until every 10 levels if you want to keep at it. 
you don't really need to worry too much about the armor but um the stats on the armor will only go up in level if you're like at a 10 level 10 level change so like you either need to be level 10 20 30 40 50 things like that oh, sorry. yeah so if you upgrade it before that it won't change the the stats on the armor like the the armor level the however like my I'm looking at a piece now it's like 228 armor that sort of thing doesn't really matter too much it's more the stats like the 3% all damage or the 9% warrior damage things like that because well, see I have the northern traveler waist and uh, that one it was level 1 Stop until I hit you. level 9 that's when I had enough uh, drag me to upgrade it so I went from 1 to 9 yeah so for is 12. 12 now for the um for the perks on it the perks to go up in level you need to be level 10 and then you level it up and it'll go up to level 10 and your because i think it has crit chance say eh, on some of the northern armor uh yeah one percent crit chance yeah so once you hit level 10 if you level it up to level 10 it will get two percent crit chance but if you level it up anywhere before hitting the 10 rank it won't change it Alright, then I'll probably just wait, because I have a lot of Dracula now. Well, what? I have 5,000, so that's probably be enough to level it up to 20. Yeah. And then I use uh, the Wolf's Helm. Yeah, same, I use that, it's got some good perks on it. And I use uh, Nikolaus' sword. Hmm. But, uh, I think, I'm not sure, but... I'm I'm looking around and I heard that there's a good weapon in Athens somewhere, so I'm just going to look for that. Yep. I think it's the Hammer of Jason. Hammer of Jason. Hmm. Uh, I don't know if you know who he is, but... Uh, yeah, Jason and the Argonauts. Yeah. Yeah, it's one of my middle names. Oh, nice. If so not, my brothers were named. Uh, continue, sorry. My brothers were named after angels, and I got the giant slayer. <laughs> nice. <laughs> um, yeah. If not, what tier are you for the mercenaries? Um, what am I? I think I'm in tier five. I might be tier four now. Let me just have nice. a quick look. I'm I'm almost uh, through tier eight. Oh nice. Yeah, I'm tier four at the moment. It's good going through certain mercenaries if you like inspect them. You can see which ones have legendary armor or weapons and things like that. I know there's um some of them that have there's one of them that has a fire staff and one of them has a Fire bow, I think, but I'm not sure. Yeah, yeah. Yes, that's it. And then you've got that. No, I don't have it yet. I the dude that has it in my one, he's way too high. Was it a girl? I can't remember. Uh, um, no, I think it's a guy, and he's level like forty-five, I think. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, so Wait, what's is there Helipop. max level? Ninety nine. Hmm. So your level will stay at ninety nine, but you'll like Yeah. Oh. Nice. Uh we're now. And what abilities did you focus on like? Did you focus on Warrior Assassin? Me, I've got 27,584 Assassin. My Hunter is 20, oh, 2,757. My Warrior is from 2,000 to 2,500. Oh my god. <laughs> it's still quite I low think. compared to when you're higher, man. At, like I could, I could likely have mine better, but there's particular sets of armor in that that I like. 
Yeah. For the, for the Appar specific. Apparently, you get armor for killing certain uh, cultists. Yeah, yeah. So every cultist gives you a piece of armor to go towards the set, and then the final cultist in each one's line gives you the weapon that goes for that set. Oh, nice. So I have, um, uh, which one do I have a few of? I think I got a couple of Achilles, or the slithering ones. Got a few of the slithering armor. I've got my Spartan war helmet. <laughs> war hero helmet. I'm using Jason's um, golden fleece as my chest piece at the moment. Oh, nice. Yeah, I got that off a uh, mercenary. So there was a mercenary That's that... Cool. Uh, it took me a while because she was level 30, so I had to <laughs> wait until I was able to bloody actually do something <laughs> to her. Well, so that means you probably just got her, uh, got the fleece. Yeah, yeah. I'm 31 now, so I was just, I was just lucky yeah. enough to come across her in the town. Or well, she came across me, because you know how they always try to hunt you down, so. <laughs> yes. I just found Pericles and Cleon. Alright. See, I knew, I knew, I don't know how to say his name, but Her Herodotus? Oh, Herodotus, yep. See, I, I knew, I kind of knew who he was, I was like, maybe it's not him, like, maybe it's just a different, like, Herodotus. Hmm. Yeah, historical as man. Like this game's pretty good with keeping these, keeping historical facts in. Yeah, good and one of my friends finished the game. Yep. And I'm not gonna say it to you because it really sucks, but he kind of spoiled the end for me, so I'm kind of pissed now. Hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying my best not to, because I do know some of what's gonna happen in the game. I just try my best not to mention anything while I stream. What are these particular keys for, man? They confuse me. You find like a lost key in that. Hmm. I've come across a couple of strange doors in some of the dungeon areas. <laughs> what is this lady up to? I'm thinking of maybe, uh... Oh god. I'm maybe thinking of, uh, once I've done Odyssey and Origins, I'm probably gonna get Valhalla. Oh yeah, no, definitely. Valhalla looks pretty damn awesome. But people it's, are um... like, uh... Yeah, I was having a look online at um, what people considered the top top ten best, or like you know the the best of the um, Assassin's Creed series. And that, um, that cheetah or whatever it's called looks really annoying. Hmm. 
They placed, um, they placed Odyssey above Valhalla for, um, But there's also the ones who believe that Origin is better than Odyssey, eh? Hmm. Yeah, I just preferred the um, the idea of travelling through Greece. Like, I got them both because I, I like, like, hard out, like both Egypt and Greek mythology. Yeah. That, that's really fun stuff to, like, read about. Yeah. Well, I see because Greece, like the gods and the Egyptian gods, are like people. Like when I talk to them about it, they're like, oh, it's pretty much the same thing. It's not at all. Hmm. There's similarities in all gods. Like in every religion, there's similarities, but there's a heck of a lot of stuff that you know they don't share, like the looks of the gods. Like Anubis, and that you can't find any Greek god that looks like Anubis. Can't find nope. any of them that look like Ra. Uh, same thing with uh, Sobek. Yeah. <clears throat> but what I like is that a lot of um, the gods in Egypt are based off like the animals in Egypt. Yeah. So there's a crocodile, like a god with crocodiles and all that. <clears throat> hmm. uh, jackals, scorpions. Hard up. I like the idea how Egypt had the whole thing with um, mummies and ther like pharaohs and all of that coming back yes. from the dead, and, and how their rituals went with burials and things like that. Yeah, you know why they would take out the heart, right? Uh, I'm not a hundred percent. I can't remember. Without a fear that it um, would come back? Uh, no, because, um, yeah. when the, like, people would be mummified, their heart would be taken out. So when they would go to Anubis, I think, uh, they would weigh the heart to, with, a, with a feather. Hmm. And if it would be heavier, they would be sent, like, to hell. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, because I know but Anubis it, it, it weighs... Oh, uh, continue. Yeah, I, I know Anubis weighs the, um, whether they're worth going to, what's it called? The Duat. Hmm. It's like, um, if you were a rich man, you could buy your way in as well. Yeah. Sort of thing. Yeah, you'd, uh, so they like buried, offerings. Yeah, and they bury, like, the pharaohs and that with treasures or the important people of their, their riches in it. One one of the saddest things I found was that if like a pharaoh were to die, then the the eunuchs in that would have to die with him. Oh, that's. But that was pretty sad. Like their servants would follow their master to the underworld. Oh my god, okay, I really have to level up now. My next quest, I have to be at least level 16, and I'm, level, I'm still level 12. Hmm. Look for those oh, gold XP I'm... missions, bro. You'll be able to do yeah, that. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm doing, and since I have to wait a bit, I might just go see... Uh... Yeah, I'm, I'm missing maybe like 200 XP, so I'm just gonna go around and see if I can do anything. I'm just gonna keep like, finding locations. Hmm. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna... I didn't go get the... The synchronized pole. Oh. Oh, no. And after that, I might end up going to get that hammer. Taking on one of the um the lion dens. Oh, so how did they kill the alpha? What the hell?
I don't know why, but I've got a really like feeling because um, I know the animus works. I think with the DNA, mm. but for some reason I kind of feel like uh, Layla and Cassandra are a bit of the same. Hmm. So I I don't know, but maybe I think maybe they're related. I'm thinking like, cause um, she modified that particular one, so I'm I'm not sure if she made it so that she had to be related, or if she modified it to the point where even just being able to use the DNA, she could look into the lives of them. Well, I think that's what, unless she was related uh, related to like uh, Ayer Bayek. Mm. I don't think she was. We we'll have to find out anyway. <laughs> oh my god, it's so tough to get up on the statue of a thing. Modern Warfare. <laughs> I've already got Cold War. Yeah, that's a big reason why I stopped uh, playing. I love the physics in this game. You can jump from the highest point in the game and land into a small pile of hay and you'll be fine. Yeah, hold up. You know that it, even at the um the level you're at now, you can jump yeah, off you... a high as place and take you, still survive it. Yeah. yeah. Once you hit anyway, level, I think even with my Pegasus, like the horse, the free one, I think I can't take fall damage with it now. Yeah, nah. When you drop off a high place, he sort of glides, glides yeah. you down and take zero damage. Once you hit level twenty, you can jump off any height and take zero damage. As nice. your character. Yeah, that's the coolest feeling, man. It's better than doing a bloody leap of faith off a high point. <clears throat> well, I remember that was a problem with the uh, origins, because sometimes you'd be like on a high place, you'd try and go down, mm. and I'd hit circle like maybe once too many, and yep. uh, it would just drop me down completely. Hmm. Oh god, never mind, I'm not doing that. It's required level 15. So you need to do like one of the bases. Wow, I'll do some salt quests. <laughs> I like how even with the different weapon types, so if you're using a sword or daggers or a spear, it, it's not that those particular types all have the same fighting style. Like, um, it depends yeah. on the actual weapon on that type, what kind of attack and, it's going to do. And I think the level. Yeah. Like, because this, um,. Like that, that Spear of Time, I can't remember what it's called, the the Harvester of Time. You get it with the Deluxe Edition, comes with the, the Time Armor. The um, That particular Spear I hard out like, because of its... Got, it's got quick poke attacks. Whereas Is this other Spear I was using, I was, it was doing slow as attacks, man. But I had sweep attacks. Is it... Um was it purple and like a bit curved? Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, I used that one too. Yeah, that's, that was one I used for the longest time. 
I, I, I Do still used it until I got the sort of uh, Nikolaus. Oh, yeah, yeah. I haven't really used the sort of Nikolaus to be honest. It's pretty good. Hmm. I think I engraved it, but I'm not sure, so I think I get fire damage. Yeah. Uh, no. No, I took 20% uh, damage, uh, 20 plus 20%. Oh no, never mind. I didn't engrave it. You know what, I might go engrave it now though. This bloody pig just ragdolled me down the hill. <laughs> oh my god. Did you fight the... Um, what's it called? It starts with a K, it's the, I think the legendary boar? Yep, yep. Yeah man, that thing, like, I, when I first went to fight it, I was doing like barely any damage. And I was like, nah, hell no. So I left, came back when I was a high level and then had better weapons. I had just these daggers and just started smoking it. I was like, eh. Yay! What level were you when you first fought it? Uh, when I first fought it, I was level 12, I think. 12 or 14, whatever its level was. And then I ended up fighting it again when I was 16. Level 16. Alright, I'll wait a bit then. It's, a, it's... You need a good set of skills. So like, um, once you unlock the hero strike, if you haven't already, when you unlock that, that's a good ability to use against it, because it does good damage. Um, I used the dagger, because it's really quick attacks. You just do like a few heavy jabs in, quick jabs in, and then dodge, and the heavy jabs, quick jabs, dodge. Yeah. Yeah, I'll see what I can engrave on the sword, and I'll probably... I might do that soon. Have you got on your bow yet? A bow? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Alright, sweet. Took ages for me to get a bow, man. Alright, let's I just leveled up. What's the name of the island that you're on? Um, the one I'm on. Um, Chaos. The oh. Chaos Island. Okay, so I'm right beside. Well, right beside you. I'm I'm on uh, Attica. Oh yeah, yeah. That's yeah, right, you in Athens, eh? yeah, what I'm thinking is, if ever I get the chance, I might sail over, because there's a little unnamed island over, uh, Samos. Yep. So if you go, if you look there, there's a, I think there might be Poseidon's trident, but I'm not sure. Hmm. Yeah, I've got an, um, I ended up going to get Poseidon's Trident. I took it, so the lions there, Yeah. Th there's lions on the island, and they, um, they're around that area. They're, they're like level 42, 45, something like that. And I went there at level 26, I think. Oh. Yeah, so I took out the two females. And then just snuck around the mail and opened the chest. Yeah, see what I what I'm probably gonna do is when I go, cause I I think, cause I'm probably gonna go like tomorrow or something when I'm level twenty. Yeah. Or maybe today if ever I hit level twenty today, I don't think so. But once I hit level twenty, I might just sneak, cause I think you can open it from the back while the like if the lines are in front of you. Yeah. I think you might be able to open it from the back of the crate. Hmm. You could lure the oh. the big line away or the little line away. 
and uh, all, the, all the lines, you could lure them away and then just crouch your way to it. I think what I could do is I could use, because I know there's a skill or an ability that lets you call in a lieutenant. Yeah. So I might, I might use that. Yeah, it'd be a good idea. Even if you, um... Uh, mm -hmm. Like, if you travelled around enough and then found heaps of viewpoints, you could level up Icarus and get him to hassle them. Oh, I need to get 90 more uh, synchronized points. Hmm. Far out, this place is wicked. Man, like, the designs in this game are just stunning. Oh, you can hold two weapons until you get level 15. Yeah, bro. You can switch between them. Alright, well, I might do like I did in, uh... Assassin's, uh... Creed Origins. I might use, like, a normal sword and a heavy weapon. Hmm. Yeah, I'm using a sword and dagger. So a sword for like medium speed attacks and then daggers for quick attacks. When I get a bit of spear or something, I'll likely chuck that on. Just for the sweep attacks, get more damage to multiple opponents. Hmm. Oh, okay, I just, I just looked at the Spear of Leonidas. You almost have it fully maxed out. Yeah, level 4. I think out of six. Yeah, I think um, the next big perks I can get, I need it at level five. So I've been, that's why I've been sort of hunting down the um, cult members. To so try and get it mixed, like, leveled up as far as level five at least, in order to um, do up some of my other skills. My abilities. Ooh, there's one at the... Uh... Andro, so I might go there and kill uh, it's the chimera. Oh, the um, the cult member. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, there yeah, you she's. Know what? I'm gonna fast travel there and I'll go kill her. Stop one. <laughs> But yeah, a lot of people said it was horrible because of, because uh, it's like basically an RPG now. So people are like, oh, it's not, it's not Assassin's Creed anymore. Like, <laughs> Assassin's Creed was fun. always role playing. It's just this but, is. Uh, I think one of the big reasons people didn't like it as much is because of how big it is. Like. And the fact that you don't have to worry too much about following the story. Yeah. Like the main story, you can just free roam and do. Even the side quests in this game feel like a part of the main story, so it's really good. Oh man, this one chick. I want to find her. Chrissy's. Be lost, the beast of Sparta. Is Cassandra's is name still Cassandra or is it uh, something else? Demos. Oh, okay. So I think the um the gameplay is the same through both. So if I were to have chosen Cassandra, it would be the same as how I'm playing yeah. as Alexios. Uh, pretty much, because I I think well as soon as you come out of the like the forge, for you yep. Cassandra shows up right. Yeah. And for you it's Elixios. Yeah. Because hmm. Elixios is the younger sibling on your one, eh? Yeah. Yeah. See, Cassandra's the baby on my. Yeah, I play Cassandra. 
a lot of people, I, I heard there was like a few people that liked Cassandra more because they didn't like Alexios' um, his voice, his, the voice yeah, actor for Alexios. It's it's kind of annoying. I actually really like it because it's like, to me, it's like Italianish. You know, I'm part Italian, so. Hmm. Yeah. But like. Oh, no. But like the um back then even their their accents and that were quite similar. That's that's they're, true too. Yeah, they're they're uh, Romans and Italians are of the same sort of culture, ain't they? Anyway, I think they're like yeah, because uh, the gods for Greeks and Romans are pretty much the same. It's just the names that changed. Hmm. Because I mean, uh, Athena is the goddess of wisdom and all that. Minerva is the exact same thing. Hmm. I mean, you think like Elixios is like and Cassandra, Spartan heritage. So yeah. Does that float into it? And it's pretty funny because I'm part Italian also. Yeah. Oh God. Don't tell the girls, bro. They love that. <laughs> Well, because I don't, like, the only part that really says I'm Italian is my last name. Yeah. And nobody really believes me when I say I'm Italian. Hmm. Well, one of my last names, the uh, the Italian part of it, it's, it's actually, because I'm a Māori as well, like, I'm, I'm more prominently Māori than anything. And, um, my Māori last name on my dad's side is actually... Originated like um, Italian soul. Nice. And I just killed the cultists. Hmm. Oh, whoa. Oh, that's hurting me. I thought maybe confirming the kill wouldn't hurt me, but... Are you in fire? Uh, no, just because they all attacked me at once, so I... I'm kind of low. Oh, I'm gonna yeah. go just see if I can confirm the kill right now, because they're not moving too fast. Hmm. Oh! I have the Boots of Agamemnon. That's right, I gotta go and find the bloody arena. Invitation Warrior the Befka Arena this is the most competitive arena in all of the Greek world. This is the last living hero of the arena. I'm seeking the best fighters to compete on the most spectacular stages for honor, pleasure, and drachma. Your reputation precedes you. If you have slain as prof prolifically or as poetically as you, should you be interested, find me in Pirate Point or my associate. My own and Pifka's warrior's wrist. Skolra, hero of the Pifka arena. Pirate point. Hmm. 
Where do you think it's power point? Oh, okay, I've got to go way over here. Alright, looks like I'm jumping on my ship. <laughs> Damn. Mm. Majority of my braves that are on will be playing Disney too. I love the fighting in this game, it's so, uh, uh, it's really good. I like that Cassandra just said, be careful not to get spotted, but, I mean, I killed everyone. Huh. Yeah, that always cracks yeah. me up, eh? Mm -hmm. Like I just finished wiping out a fort and then I leave and he's like You have to be careful in this area. So I pray <laughs> they're all dead man. You just finished killing them all, why you wanna be careful? <laughs> just gonna check if the teacher called me or anything. <laughs> Fun I just uh, completely discovered Andros. Ready for sale. Hm. Welcome back. Where shall we go? Running speed. Yep. Uh, I'm not sure about my height. Like five, Master. nine, I think. But um, thirty. More speed. Increase speed. Uh, you can call me Eddie, by the way. But uh, sixteen five nine. He's American, bro. It's like a normal thing in America. Oh, <laughs> 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 you think you're an adult? Turns out that they, they can barely speak. I actually need to check my height. I haven't checked my height since I was a kid. I'm like probably 5'10, 5'11, something like that. I don't know. My brother's like 6'2, I think, 6'3. How tall, bro? Oh, you know how tall my teacher, my science teacher is? 
the uh, like five two maybe. Damn. Oh no, he's really he's really small. What's his nationality? Uh, Quebecois. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm I'm a Quebecer. Quebec. Oh, where am I? Yeah, uh, yesterday was pretty funny because you were saying like, oh yeah, people in Canada are usually so nice, and I was about to text uh, to write in the chat, uh, except Quebec. Because sometimes in public you're gonna be speaking English, and then an old lady or old guys that come to you is like, "Hey, we're in Quebec. Like, speak French." <laughs> what? Fierce ta gueule quand on est sa Hmm. Punta. Isn't that the like slot or something? <laughs> oh. He must have been happy. Oh, it's like one of the kids in my class. He did, he doesn't know how to speak Spanish, but uh, one of his friends told him if you yell this word, uh, it means thank you, miss. So he <laughs> yelled, uh, puta, miss. Oh, hell. It was pretty funny. <laughs> Like, oh my gosh, you're so kind. You call me a bitch? She's telling me inside my beautiful, intelligent, talented, caring. No. Well, it's because <laughs> the, the worst part is she was a Spanish teacher to our. It was our geography teacher, so. What the hell is it? How did you know? The beer on the. I hate that when you place, you still take damage. The what? Like you brace and you still take damage. Oh yeah. yeah. Yeah, I think I might die. Oh. Olaf, no. <clears throat> hold up, hold up. What happened here? Huh. It's like, uh, destroyer did nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Man, Otaku. You know what's in that game. <laughs> That's right.
Shit, where did I park? Why do these people live on this island? I'm on um the volcano island, the the forge of the world. Mount Edna? Uh, what's the name of this one? Because I, I know the volcano that like was a forge for uh, like Hephaestus and the Cyclops was Mount Edna. Mm, this one's um, Anafi. It's part of Thera and Nisiro oh. Islands. Hey, I'll, I'll be back later. Three days, we. Alright, yes. Two days. Bye. What happened? Shipwreck. You know about rolling down in the pim nip 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 beaver. It's got a good beat. Class it up for your gun. I'm curious. Can you come across the Kraken in this? Hmm. Well, that's sad. Like, the Kraken is, <laughs> is a huge part of the Hades mythos. What's up, kid?
Man, I feel bad eating Doritos on the stream. <laughs> it was noisy. And our world famous Minotaur Tunics. Tunics. Minotaur Tunics. One size fits all. I don't see how one yeah, size. This kid needs a pay rise. My name's Arsenius. If you want to know how to defeat the Minotaur and become the Greek world's most famous warrior, then this is the tour for you. You see me wearing the golden fleece, right, boy? You sell it well, kid. Let's go on <laughs> your tour. <laughs> I'm sure he does, he's looking straight at me. Yo, this kid, they definitely need to give him a pay rise. <laughs> he's taking me on, uh, he's, he's my tour guide on Pithica. So that's Sinus. I've heard many tales of the Minotaur. They usually make the sales sound more heroic. Well, Sparta's not known for its quality education, is it? <laughs> Next thing you tell me, well, savage little punk. Let's just continue the tour. Hey, in Pefka, the hero's always right. This way. Look out! That rock's actually the Minotaur drop. He must have just been through here. I can't believe we missed. This guy. Warriors from all over the Aegean come to Pefka to face the mighty Minotaur, hoping to claim his head as the ultimate prize. So far, well, <clears throat> he's killed all of them, but <laughs> drinking freshly squeezed Minotaur Hoof Elixir will no doubt give you the oomph you need to triumph. Where does this Minotaur Hoof Elixir come from? The hoof of the Minotaur, obviously, is right there in the name. Huh. What does this elixir do, besides give me oomph? Depends what ails you, friend. Sore throat? Slow healing ones? Itchy beats on parts unmentionable. Will it cure the regret of taking unnecessary tours? Yes. <laughs> and let me guess, you've got a vial ready for purchase. Just like Pepper always said, never leave home without the ground up hooves of a mythical creature. You never know when you'll need some Minotaur hoof elixir. You made a wise purchase, my physically responsible friend. Now come, there's so much more to see. <laughs> I'm not saying I'm responsible for breaking the Minotaur statue, but I'm also not saying I'm not responsible. <laughs> Man, I used to main shotguns back in the Black Ops days. And so concludes our tour. I never really... I didn't learn anything. I never really got into sniping because until Disney. Hmm. 
<laughs> Half of 32. It's, um, oh, what am I up to? 16 back. Shouldn't listen to the boy. A serious. Where are you, my friend? Hello, little boy. You want to know a secret? I kill little boys like you. You know that? You know that, Arsenius, you little shit? Ah, well done, warrior. You passed the... Survive the thugs test. Not, uh, not everyone passes that. You've earned an extra 10% off our world-famous Minotaur tunics. Or... <laughs> you know what? You've given me a great tour. A tour of friendship, which I would totally pay for. Here, a large drachmi fee for your fantastic friendship tour. A pleasure doing business with you. Hey! Yeah? <laughs> What's it like being a Mystios? Yeah, could be worse. This ain't gonna kill you boys, it's just gonna beat your ass. I tried to kill our seniors, didn't work. I liked them, and they played me for a fool. up here I'm gonna get the synchro and then I will finish up the stream I'll try to do an earlier start for you bro I'll probably jump off, have a risk, get, get some sleep. It's like going on half three in the morning. <laughs> if I'm a stream earlier, I'll have to go to sleep earlier. <laughs> I 
Ah, mire todo. Easily team, bro. I haven't gotten bored of it at all. <laughs> There you go, took a photo of my pit. Yeah. No, no, no. <laughs> I'll show you how send it to you. When it shows up, if it shows up. It's probably not going to show up. No. Well, it won't show up yet. You see. Hey? <laughs> you guys gotta suck. Out. Shop for tuning into the stream. Oh, sorry for you who just tuned in. I was just ending up now. I was I'll try and stream earlier. Probably another hmm, my time. I'll say about 11, 12 ish. 11 ish in the morning, 12 ish in the hour. But gee, let me head out now, finish up. You guys have a good one. Peace out.